Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. Let me say this. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, family. Welcome to the mental house. Welcome to this damn mental house. You know, I didn't want y'all to think, so I thought I'd need to come back and make a clarification um, that I think that Fanny is funny. I'm sorry, I hate that Fanny. Fanny is um, totally innocent. What she's innocent of is not being a part of the paperwork in those divorce proceedings. And for that, I'm grateful. Okay? But it does not excuse the fact that, you know, you are having this a relationship, which is okay, un- but under these circumstances, it's just not. And if I had just a semblance of a brain, I would know that this is a complete distraction. Um, And you already know that you are trying to prosecute, or you are prosecuting the highest white man the country has had. No matter how crazy, no matter how dysfunctional, no matter how uh, 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 deceitful, he was still an ex-president, right? And if you think, because, uh, again, I think that only black women or a black person would have the balls to really bring something against powerful white men um, because other white men protect the white men and that's just how it goes so no matter what the impropriety what the improprietor or um or the semblance of crap in the relationship no matter what crap has been proven hardly no white man is going to prosecute another white man they're going to make excuses for him so if you notice that Letitia James um, Fonnie Willis and anybody else that would be in this position of power would do the same thing, especially if they was black or, in my opinion, or brown. Because, uh, you know, wh- how is it going to stop? You know, you prosecuting everybody else, throwing everybody else in jail, especially uh, black people, and then when you get to this guy... You make all kinds of excuses, even though he's violating people, violating the laws. He's a crook. He's selling documents. But you make all kinds of excuses. So finally, since you know that this is the way America runs is racist country, it would behoove you to just be like, okay, look, this is too much of a distraction. Um, and nothing is going to stop me no matter what. I see how the Republicans are playing. Um, and I'm going to go forward and I am going to eliminate this Nathan guy from our team. I mean, he, I'm going to have to take him off the case. I have plenty of, uh, help in this office that are competent, uh, and know how to get this, uh, Rico case moving. And then if that doesn't happen, then Nathan, you should sit your, you should recuse yourself. You should just say, look, this is causing too much problems for Fani. And we've come too far to let this case be thrown out by bullshit. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to recluse myself. That don't mean that, you know, you you and Fani uh, got to uh, end your relationship. However y'all do it, do it. Um, I love it. I just don't want you to jeopardize this case with y'all damn love affair and you know how they gonna operate i'm just glad that her name wasn't in the divorce papers but finally you know what you got to do either you gonna recuse your uh, this guy or he should recuse himself and let's get back to work okay because right now it's not looking good i mean it's just the impropriety no taxpayer gonna want to pay for your rendezvous with this guy you know, and we thought they act like there was going to be a lot of explosion in your divorce papers. The papers are unsealed and ain't nothing there, okay? 
But what is there is that those couple trips that was taken, you know, uh, by y'all. And mm -mm. is that taxpayer dollars? You don't want to do that. So make a choice. You've done a great job so far. Finally, don't blow it. Especially on no crap like this. All right. If you like what you hear, subscribe, share the channel. See you in the next video.